Hey everyone, in today's video I'm going to show you how to build this boat with this powerful propeller out the back. It takes a few steps, but I'm about to show you how. The first step, we need to head over to the Gemimic Shrine. This is where we're going to obtain the propeller and the motor. If you remember this shrine, you do need to have electricity to operate this propeller. Now, to obtain both of these, we will now need to fuse them, one to each weapon, and they have to be a separate weapon. Once we fuse both of the items to both weapons, we now need to take that weapon over to Terrytown. Here, we're able to break them apart so we can use them for other fusible objects later. We'll have to pay Pelasan 20 rupees to have that done. Just select the weapon you want to be unfused. After the first weapon was unfused, now choose the second weapon to be unfused. When both are unfused, now you want to create the fan. Fuse together the propeller to the top of the motor. Now you have the build in your auto build library for the future. Now we need to get a boat. The boat is located on Tinaco Island. Once we get to the island, you can see we have three boats to choose from. We also have a few batteries on the island, as well as a rocket. We don't really need to use these, but if you don't have a lot of battery power, it wouldn't hurt to add the batteries to the boat. The first thing you want to do is to auto build that motor and the propeller that you fused together in Terrytown. Next, you need to get a shock emitter to give it power. And now we'll fuse that to the back of the motor. With that completed, now we'll just fuse this to the back of the boat. I like to try to center as much as possible. And next, now we need a steering wheel some way to steer the boat. So we'll just load that and mount that into the center of the boat. And the boat doesn't move on land, so we need to move it further into the water so when we get into it, we can set sail. Just hop on in and take control of this boat, and there we go. Yes, this motor is great on this boat. This is such a great thing to have in your auto build, because now you built it, now you can build this whenever you want. Just add it to your favorites and you can pull it out and build it whenever you need to go on the water anywhere. Look at this amazing view too. This is just so cool. Guys, I hope you liked today's video and I hope it helped you out. I definitely want to hear it in the comments if you made this or plan on making it. It's quite simple. And also, having this electronic motor with the propeller on it we could probably use that for other things as well.